I'm back for part two of the video and I wanted to share the setup of my new two notebooks by Rowena. You can hear little Seamus is with us. I'll include a photo of him. He had his hair cut this past weekend so he looks extra adorable. Um, so I did take everything out of my passport and I just have a couple of zipper pouches left in it. Um, this just has some new inserts that we have at Peaky Dory Designs. Um, this one I've just got some extra stuff in it in case I need it. Um, this one has some, it has a new notebook I made. This is a uh, Peaky Dory Design dot grid and we're experimenting with some uh, limited edition covers for them. This is a um, insert from Rowena that I got with one of my notebooks. That's the craft. And then this right here is a um, this is a Foxy Fix dashboard for a standard Midori that I actually cut down to fit inside of a B6 limb. Um, this just has Peaky Dory design stuff in it, so no one needs to see that. Um, now this one right here, this is my standard one with the pocket on the inside. And what I have in here is, like, here's another design that we're, we're playing with, taking some of my photos and making covers out of them. And this is an insert that is our Strathmore paper. And what I do is all of the different artwork or art supplies I have or different types of highlighters or pens, I check to see, you know, how they all work. There's a little eyeball I drew out of a blue pencil. <laughs> Um, just to see how they work. A little pocket. This is a Taroko folder. This is just some scrap of paper that I collaged. Um, and this is um, Tomoe River paper. We don't offer inserts in Tomoe River paper, um, but I know a lot of people use it. And so I, I wanted to see how, <laughs> like those are the mermaid markers. I wanted to see how the art supplies that I have worked on it. These were so much fun to do. And what I did was I put the, the these are ink tents, uh, distress, no, no, they're the distress crayons. And I put it down, but then I smudged it with a baby wipe and it gave it that really cool effect. But I used a too permanent of an ink and then pressed too hard for the stamp. Um, this is a new one that I just made the other day that were toying with. And this is um, the Kokuyo paper that we use for the um, A5 inserts. And I just wanted to see how they do with different things. And then a Midori zipper pouch. And then this is just regular photocopy paper. I wanted to see how they work on that. Um, but what we're here for are my two new little beauties. Let me zoom in a little bit to help. Um, let's start with the wallet first because it's pretty simple. So this is the new leather that I got that I don't even know the name, but look how gorgeous it is. And it smells, oh, it smells wonderful. So what we have in here is, let me zoom in just a smidge more. I have, um, this is one of the uh, Midori folders, the Traveler's folder, and then I have the new um, writing board. I, I still have it in the plastic. I haven't taken it out of the plastic. Um, I got it from Tokyo Pen Shop, I think. Here is my Peaky Dory Design monthly calendar. We're going to be performing Harry Potter with the movie playing above us with the Tulsa Symphony the weekend of the 18th. So I'm looking forward to that. Lots of Nutcracker and church gigs. Um, 
and then some receipts and stuff. And then here's another design that we're toying with for covers of notebooks to have some limited editions. So here are just some, this is my dot grid, Peaky Dory Design dot grid that I just, you know, take notes in. And then this is a Taroko Design um, zipper pouch where I have like a driver's license, a credit card, and then um, a zipper pouch where I've got cash in. But I have here, this is that new um, October, November, December that I have in Russian, where I have the month and then also the week on two pages. So that's what I have in there. And this has four um, elastics, but I only have stuff on three right now. And it looks really good. The pen is the only thing as the overhang. But this one here, this is the new, let's zoom out just a smidge. This is my new stag. Let me get those out of the way. And let's see what we have in here. So the first thing you'll see is I have my B6 Slim monthly calendar, September of 2017 through December of 2018 with a book binder clip. And here we are in November, and so it goes through, oh, we're finally gonna take a honeymoon. We got married in February and we're taking a honeymoon in June the following year. <laughs> um, so there's that through December of 2018. And here I have another, this is a Foxy Fix dashboard. That's a Coco Daisy thing. Um, and I cut it down so now it, it kind of acts like a um, folder, but I also have some of the Target dollar spot. I got one up on the front, one in the back, little pocket in the back. So I've got four pockets in case I need some storage space. And then this is a folder that I made. I had some interesting scrap paper that was um, like vintage pattern design. And so I made a four pocket folder. You can see the back. I just thought it looked so cool with the pattern print on it. Um, but what I have in here is the uh, month on two pages, week on two pages in the B6 Slim, where you have the month. See, I have some more Harry Potter stickers. Um, and then I have this. I don't have a, I didn't, I don't have a writing board I wanted to cut down. So this is the Hobonichi Weeks, and this is last year's colors. And so it has a little marker for today. And here we are today. I haven't really filled out much in here. Um, some more Harry Potter stickers for that concert. Um, there's the back of that. Then this right here is a Plannerpedia insert, and I use it to keep track of students' attendance. I did have this in the A5 size. Um, <clears throat> she doesn't have it in the B6 slim size, but what I did was I trimmed properly on the top, and then I just cut it the size of a B6 slim. Um, so it's the standard Midori digital download, just to keep track of my students um, for the for the year, for their lessons. And there I put Rowena's little business card. Now this is, you'll see it is a B6 Slim uh, card zipper pouch. And this I got from Taroko shop. Um, I only have just some little Korean post-it notes in the back. And in here, I keep some more post-it notes just in case I need them. And then here I have a grid notebook. Um, I'm going to be taking some notes about a bariatric diet that we're going to be, or lifestyle that we're going to be doing soon. Courtney Little at Raven Inc. has been um, a good um, role model for all that she's doing, and so I wanted to check that out. Um, so there you go. Just a quick little look at these two beautiful notebooks that I received today from 
Rowena. Um, if you have any questions, leave them down below in the comment section, and I will get back with you as soon as I can. So I will try to link, um, I will definitely link Rowena at Sojourner. Uh, USA.net, Peaky Dory Designs, and some of the other stuff that I have in here. Okay, thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.